It was a beautiful morning in Los Santos. Frey was just finishing a run when he noticed a brown streak, who Frey could see was on the verge of an existential crisis. Are you feeling well? asked Frey. I can't complain, said the brown streak, but he said it unconvincingly. Frey wanted to. Great wanted to cheer his friend up, and eventually Brown Streak spoke up. I love my branch line, he said, but I can't help but wonder what's beyond the blockade that stops us from entering Las Venturas. Freight tended to the little Brown Streak and said that sometimes the best travels are those we can only dream about. <laughs> Brown Streak wasn't listening. He was too busy thinking about how he was going to charge through the blockade the moment his opportunity arose. Later that day, Brown Streak was getting ready for his usual run where he'd deliver cargo like half a mile down the line because none of the map was unlocked yet. He was just about to start when he felt something fall onto him. Ah! He looked back. It was one of the local gang members. Ow! And another. Ah! And another. One of the gang members ran to the front of Brown Shriek and kindly asked him to drive as fast as he could. Could you do that for me? Oh, yes, said Brown Streak, while somehow making eye contact. And just then, a motorbike pulled up alongside Brown Streak, and CJ, the driver, let out a sigh, as if to say this wasn't the first time he'd done this today. Brown Streak raced away like never before, but much to the annoyance of the chasers, but they didn't give up. We've got to get those fools, said the heavy set one. Follow that train! And the race was on. Pleasantly, a Glendale was taking a break on the crossing while his driver was. Oh. Suddenly, everyone began to find a little Bang, bang, dicka, 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 bang, bang, bang! with the heaviest set one not hitting anything whatsoever. One of the gang members slipped and was clinging on desperately to Brown Street. At last, they had a perfect aim at one of the gang members when... That's great! The woman started to say hello. Oh, I get it. Brown Street was tired. He wasn't used to high-speed chases and bike shooting at him. He had begun to give up all hope, when suddenly, just around the corner, his luck started to change. There was a barrier blocking the other track. Take the high road on the right! They managed to dodge the barrier just in time. Look the fizzling fireboxes out, CJ! The train! He yelled, as an oncoming train came from the other side in a hurry. Brown Street could see Las Venturas. It was far away in the distance, but Brown Street, it looked closer than ever. The gang members must have not known about the blockade on Frederick Bridge, and when they found out that the path was blocked, they had horror on their faces. But Brown Street was afraid to give up on his dreams. I'm gonna ice these fools, man, said the heavy set fellow. You've done it! Hooray! cheered the gang members. Brown Streak's face was a little sore, but as he rolled along to a new adventure, he couldn't be any happier. <laughs> CJ and the heavy set fellow weren't allowed on the other side of the island and slowed it to a halt. But they still were determined. Don't worry, we'll try again tomorrow, said the heavy set one. After all, all you have to do is follow the damn train, CJ!